I want to talk about something and some people may know how to do it, but some people may not know how to do it. When you correct someone, first of all, make sure you are correct. If you are telling someone what they are doing wrong, make sure you have the evidence first before you come to them and try to correct them. Don't go to someone and say that, hey, you are doing this wrong. Okay, if you say that, make sure that you are able to prove it. Make sure that you are able to explain it. But because if you can't, <laughs> what is the use? So, I guess you can tell a person, hey, I can be wrong, but this is how I feel. Okay, fine. But if you are being definite and saying, hey, this is what you are doing and that is a sin. Okay, show me what I am doing wrong. Show me, give me evidence of what I am doing wrong. Make sure that you can explain it. Because if you can't, <laughs> if you can't explain to someone what they are doing wrong, when you are accusing them of doing something wrong, is that person going to listen to you the next time? Now, some people may, but some people may not because they are not going to see you in the right light. So before you accuse anyone of anything, make sure that you can explain it in words, not just go by your feelings, but you are saying it as if you are certain when you really aren't. Next. What else? Yes. When you correct a person, don't be rude. Hey, you are a very sinful fornicator. You are evil. You are wrong. You are going to hell. Why would you say that to someone? You come up to a person. You are low down. You are not going to do anything right. I pity you. You are a hypocrite. <laughs> you are so sinful. If you call yourself a Christian, that right there is not correcting. That is insulting. Insulting and correcting are two different things. Me just calling you random names, that is wrong. But if I come to you or say to you, look, you are having sex before a marriage. And as you know, sex before marriage is a sin. And if you want to be right with God, you are going to have to stop having sex before marriage. Now, I can help you with that if you want. That is correcting. Coming to a person, you are a hypocrite. You are going to hell. Burn in hell now. <laughs> Why? 
Why would you say that? That is rudeness. That is insulting. Yes, a person may get offended by me coming to them and saying to stop fornicating. Yes. But that is much more acceptable than coming to a person and calling them these insulting or insulting them with random words. We have to be careful of what we say. We can't be rude to people. I could easily say, hey, you filthy fornicator. <laughs> Why would I say that? When I can say, hey, what you are doing, having sex before marriage is wrong. So you need to stop that. And some people may say, well, I am a grown woman or man. You have no right to say that to me, whatever. But coming to them in that way is best other than coming to them and insulting them. I pray that this makes sense. Now, at least I am warning them other than insulting them. So I pray that this makes sense. Let me stop here. God bless you.